Hi guys, I'm back. Another experiment with that crazy pinky thing. I just did one and I'm doing it again, but a little bit different. I'm still putting it on my canvas. I'm still putting paint around it, but I'm not going to allow the pink to go beneath my base layer. I'm going to pull it up and then see what happens. There are just a little bit of air bubbles. Just get rid of them like this. Well, what color do we take? I'm starting with the brilliant green. I believe it's called brilliant green. I'm gonna finish it because it is to finish all my leftovers I used for a painting for the customer. Then I have some beautiful blue. I believe it's greenish blue, but I'm not sure. Why don't I begin in the tail? It looks like a tail to me. I want to finish this one too because it's a very beautiful color. Like I said before, I don't know what's all in these paints. It could be the pet silk. It could be the coconut hair oil. But both make beautiful cells. Now I want a bright color, like yellow, starting in the tail. Then this beautiful dark purple. Going through the yellow, oh that that side is full. What do I have more? Some light blue. Maybe I can put in some white a drop. No, I want to put in the violet. And then, well, if it don't flow over, in the tail, maybe put in a drop of white, like this. Wow, maybe in the tail. Well, that's, oh, my stick is flowing away. Now I want to put it up because there's already flowing paint under, well, one, two, three. See what's going to happen. I'm on a torch, clean up my hands a little bit. There's still going paint under. It's like the open, uh, open cup. This looks a little bit to me like an animal, but I'm always seeing things that are not there. Just let it flow a little bit. Maybe I can help it just very softly. There are beautiful things popping up. I don't know if they are going to be there later on. I hope so. Well, I wait enough. I want to tilt. This is not a white base layer. It's a, a little bit uh, yeah, cream color, we say.
I want to go a little bit in the round and then I think I want to put my stick through it. always thinking about things to do. I want to get me a stick. See? Just like this. What that's going to bring. Flow over this corner. Just a little bit. Maybe then go to that corner. Go back. To this corner. And then go back. This corner. Yeah. There's another violet. But it's okay. I like violet and purple. I just want to put on this corner just a little bit more. I really love the colors what you can do with your leftovers isn't it beautiful well let's go over it with my heat torch getting too close. Julie says you have to take more than, yeah, I don't know the word in English, afstand. Go higher, she says. That, that, is, that I pronounce it that way. I'm just seeing some air bubbles popping. Well, this is a very beautiful tool, thanks to my strange pinky thing. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put the camera out, wait a little bit, see what's happening. Everybody does what he likes to do with his own painting, of course. When you put your balloon in the cells, you create beautiful flowers like this. You see, when you do it in the lines, it's a very bit different. Sometimes you can put them in a place when you think there's not much other color. Try to get some other colors. And I always think not too much. I won't bore you with too much of this because I believe it has some beautiful spots now. My last check, maybe here in the white. Well, the white stays white. No, I'm not going to do. I like it. Well, if you liked what I did, and you want to see more of me, subscribe. You want, you would make me very happy if you do. I'm not speaking very good English, but I'm trying. 
so you all of the world can see what I'm doing. Thank you.